And oh. inside the castle itself, he apparently did some terrible things. You touched the damn kids, didn't you, Michael? <laughs> We're about to take a look at 10 literal castles, some of which can't even be given away, and somehow Michael Jackson is involved with one of them. Owning and living inside a castle is not something most people can even imagine. True. That's why it may surprise True. you to hear that some castles can't sell, even there's, for one dollar. There's, there's no very... way. There's no way, dude. It's gotta be clickbait, right? It's literally everybody's f***ing dream to live in a castle. I would, I would, I mean, I would, I would pay a dollar for a castle. This has gotta be fake. It's gotta be fake. These castles simply won't sell. For various reasons, people do not want to live there. From one of America's okay, biggest them. castles, which simply won't sell. I feel to like castles, Italy is giving away for free. First of all, America has castles, and you guys didn't even tell me. I've been, I'm 26. I didn't even know we had, ca where are the castles at here in America? Second of all, Italy, if you're having trouble giving away your castle, just call me, bro. I'll, I'll take it off your hands. I'll do you the solid. Can't give away a castle. You're not even trying, okay? You're not even asking the right people then. Let's be real. Castello di Blera. This, like this 11th music. century castle can be found in Lazio, Italy. It's pretty near to Rome. It's incredibly large, with a massive clock tower too. You I'm down. You may think that the castle in the center of the town would cost a lot of money, but- It's in the- it's a castle in the center of town. That's like literally every fantasy RPG game I've ever played in my life. Give it to me. I will take it right now. No, Italy is trying to give it away for free. This is because Italy is trying to rejuvenate its landmarks. But there's a catch when it comes to buying this castle. Buying? That is that you need it's to renovate dollars. it and turn it into a tourist attraction. You can mm. live in it, but you need to make sure that people mm. can visit mm. it. There's always a catch. There's always a catch, boys. There's always a catch. I'm not doing hard work. I'm sorry. You can keep the castle. I changed my mind. A dollar, I'll give you a dollar. Ten dollars even, sure. Hard work. Pass. The inside of Castello de Blera does guy? not look so great. Why doesn't it's he just buy it? He's got all that money. Very old. But if you're willing to spend a few thousand dollars on renovations, you get a free castle. Yo, Mr. Beast, I, y you're not going to believe that I thought of the greatest video idea for you. I literally, okay, say it with me, Beast Castle. What do you mean, how did I get your number? He hung up on me. Kansas Castle. No shot. Castles There's no shot. Only found There's in nothing in Kansas. European cities. Uh, you can also find them in the good old USA. Uh, Kimball Castle they at, is located though? in Manhattan, Kansas. Manhattan. The outside is in a very old, traditional Sounds... style, and the inside is also very oh, elegant. And... Do man, that's 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 not a castle. Okay, there's a refrigerator right there. I can see the fridge. There's not. A, it's not a castle. There's a stove. Okay, I, they didn't even have stoves back then. I don't think. And I don't know what the catch with this one is, but it's probably just the fact that it's in Kansas and literally nobody gives. I don't even know. Hey Siri, where's Kansas? Kansas is a state in the Midwestern United States. See, even Siri just thinks it's in the Midwest somewhere. No one knows where Kansas is. Inside, there are many large bedrooms and a grand foyer. There are also formal dining rooms and a great room. The castle is situated on one and a half acres of wooded land. Only the entire an, what outside is made of limestone. And although it's not as old as some European castles, 1932 is not a castle, bro. That's just a home from 32. That's just kind of bigger than the rest of them and looks like a castle. It's not really a castle. It's not. It's not. Really. It was built in 19. 32. But for various reasons, no one wants to buy this Kansas castle. It's been on the market for many years, but there's been no takers. It's one in reason Kansas. why is because it's far too big for most people. A lot of people would find it too strange to live in a castle. Also it literally says castle on the on the on the wall there. That's kind of dope though. That's kind of dope, but I would have to change my last name to Kimball to make it sound really badass. Also, no one's complaining it's too big, okay? They just can't afford it. Just be honest with us. No one's walking around like Dang it, this castle's just too big for me. I mean, it's a fucking castle. What do you expect? The limestone would lead to thousands of dollars in heating bills every year. Also, True. because it's pretty old, there would be lots of maintenance costs as well. Right, this just like my back. This means that no matter how much the price of this castle drops, no one wants to buy. The upkeep costs. Castello cost. di Montefiore. Ooh, is this another the Italian Castello one? The Castello di Montefiore is another castle Italy is giving away for yes. free. Now, like free! Come on, Mr. Beast, pick up the phone. I've got a great idea. Okay, okay, picture this. Two beast castles. Two beast castles. Don't get a restraining order, okay? All right, let's see what the catch is with this one. The other castle, you will need to renovate and rejuvenate this castle. You can convert it into a hotel, spa, restaurant, uh, or another tourist this, attraction. You could, why not all of them? you need to demonstrate to the Italian government how you're going to do this. 
The castle is incredibly large, okay. and if you're worried about I, the end of the world, with, then have no that's fear. What I want it's also with the heavily castle. fortified. There's a massive Hell yeah, wall, bro. which makes it very hard for intruders to get anywhere near that's, you. That's, I mean, I'm not really sure who's playing City Siege in real life here, but it sounds like buying a castle for zero dollars is probably the best strategy. This is why people like Jeff Bezos are so boring. Like, bro, you have unlimited money, and there's just literal castles out there that the government of, of Italy will just give you for free if you can just replace some stones bro i would have every fucking castle i would have every fucking castle if i was as rich as these old white men you can also keep a lookout using the gigantic lookout posts and walls mm, yes classic and the grand lookout tower posts. also gives you amazing views of the surrounding area the castle was built in the 13th century and is situated in the marquee region of okay. course like Love the other region. italian castle the inside is old and abandoned so you're telling me i can play luigi's mansion in real life but instead of mansion it's castle old abandoned means haunted yes sign me up for the haunted free abandoned luigi's castle i would like to do that please why's your castle this castle is located in belgium it's behind a gigantic oak gate and is That's surrounded kinda with greenery and a fish rich pond tell me it's this a moat. castle was renovated as recently as 1995. wait all of the roofs have been renovated and insulated i man say insulated this was renovated when i was one that's how old i am they're literally building castles while i was alive the okay. inside space alone is over five they didn't have chairs back in castle days okay they didn't have with not with the not with looking like this and i'm pretty sure that's a laptop in the back you're not fooling me with the castle it's a house it's Outside just a big house a massive patio and that's kind of beautiful i've changed i changed my mind in total is seven acres nice there's nice. even many guest Little houses a land. private cafe N and outdoor storage buildings too my man said private cafe so i could walk outside of my castle stroll past the moat and enter into my very own fucking starbucks uh bitch yes what's the catch what i I, I'm, I gotta call these guys. I gotta call these guys. My own cafe and guest house. I'm just gonna have the employees live in the guest houses. So uh, it's gonna be a 24 seven Starbucks for me only. That way when my basic ass wants an iced vanilla latte with oat milk at 3.30 in the morning, I could just walk over there and we got your boys there. But What's there the are catch? various reasons why no one has I, bought this car. I know. It's it was over coming. an hour's drive away from the nearest city. Not Brussels. fine. It's also Brussels? pretty impractical Who cares about as Brussels? most people don't have the money to live in a castle. Okay, also, the so castle give it. is far too big for most people no, to live in. No, don't lie to me again. You're lying to me again. No one's complaining about the size of their fucking castle. If that place is a dollar, I'm gonna need you to call me right now. I don't care if I'm an hour away from Brussels, okay? Oh, my castle's too big and it's an hour away, but it was a dollar and it has a Starbucks. I bet half you in the comments section have a dream of living an hour away from civilization. Real quick, over 80% of you guys are not subscribed to the channel, so make sure you go down there, click that sub button. Thank you, and drop a like while you're down there. Why not, right? Is that asking too much? Okay, okay, sorry. Neverland Ranch. As a kid, I'm sure you wished you could own your very own theme park. Not well, a castle, but I'll can, take it. And it's complete with a castle. Okay, Neverland I Ranch, take it back. Located in California, is oh, it's a in massive Cali, bro. theme park. It spans 2,700 acres. This is the there one with Michael Jackson. This pods, is the one. A 50 seat movie theater, tennis courts, a dance studio, and a Disney themed train. Homie said tennis courts. We've got multiple tennis courts. And you travel between one and the other with your literal train. Why is no one bought this yet? What's the catch? Let's find out the catch. There are also guest houses and a massive swimming pool. On paper, no Sycamore cafe. Ranch, which was renamed Neverland Ranch, is worth $100 million. But That's... it's been on the market for decades and no one it's wants to buy it. More money They've dropped I... the price down a lot, all the way to 30 million. 70% off, boys. The reason Let's go. Why no one wants to buy this castle is because of its dark past. Dark it past. used to be owned by the pop singer Michael Jackson. Oh. And inside the castle itself, he apparently did some terrible things. You touched the damn kids, didn't you, Michael? Listen, conspiracies aside, okay? All of Michael Jackson's catalog is filled with absolute bangers that hold up to this day. And in fact, is more of a reason for me to want this castle. Hey mom, can I have $31 million? No, I just want to be the next Michael Jackson. But it has two tennis courts. Sorry, my mom said I can't go. So that's why even though this castle is $70 million underpriced, no one is buying it. That seems fake, but Castle okay. of Caprarica. In southeastern Italy is this gigantic Another Italy. castle. The Italy's just got all sorts of castles. They're just giving them away. They're just like, oh, you, you want a castle? Oh, this is a doll. This one's free. You can have the, oh, you just got to rent it. Behind gigantic stone walls. 
But behind those walls is the luxurious castle and a no swimming pool way. too. Spread over two floors, no there are 12 way, bedrooms bro. and 12 bathrooms. Show me that pool again. The garden spans two and a half acres. That's crazy. No shot. No shot. Look at this. I mean, that window kind of looking shitty though. I'm not going to lie. That window looks like it's, you know, in the middle of the Bronx. But you have a literal fucking garrison and city walls around your castle. That's so cool. That's huge. That's huge. But no one's buying this castle for many reasons. For one, the maintenance costs are enough to bankrupt Again. even the richest of people. Uh, the gardening costs for the acres of land would also be tremendous. It's mm -hmm. also pretty far away from any major Italian cities. And okay, for many people, well, this castle is simply too big to live in. Don't look at me. Let's come back to reality, okay? No one said that. Literally no one said that. If you are interested in buying a castle, your expectation is that it's going to be massive. No one's looking at listings of homes on their phone and they're like, oh, look, this castle. Oh, I was kind of hoping the castle would be two bedrooms, one and a half bath. But it says here it's 17 bedrooms and three guest houses and a cafe. That's just way too much. No one's mad it's too big. It's just that no one has the balls to buy it. Listen, Jeff Bezos. If you don't buy it, you're a put it is what it is. I don't make the rules. But how much is it though? Quebec Castle. Oh, they don't tell us. Okay, great. Did you know hidden in snowy Canada, there's yeah, a massive I'm not castle? Interested. The modern castle is luxurious, that's actually, gigantic, that and actually, has many pools. That's really beautiful. But wait a minute. Simple. Holy sh**. Dude, that's actually gorgeous. That's fucking beautiful. But wait a minute. I how is the pool not frozen over? It's Canada, right? So, I mean, come on. Right, th this is actually insane, not though. interested. There are eight bedrooms and nine bathrooms and 50 rooms in total. The entire property is on 5.25 acres of Holy land. Shit. There are 17 fireplaces and a wine cellar. The 17 fireplaces! There's like double the fireplaces than there are rooms. How the fuck does that even work? Does every room have two fireplaces? I don't even understand. It's like you're literally buying fireplaces and it just comes with a castle. There's also a gym and a spa for some TLC. Ooh, the castle that spa was built good. by ice hockey player Mario Lemieux. I but thought it was gonna be great. No matter how honestly. long this is on the market, no one will buy it. Wait, First there's two pool hang on, there's a spa and there's a pool here, and then th this is this is a pool too, right? So we've got two pools and a spa. Holy sh! Look at all the chimneys. I didn't even notice that. That's all the fireplaces, bro. He wasn't f***ing around. It's so First beautiful. off, it's in the middle of nowhere. And oh. most people can't afford to live in such a big castle. Fair also, enough. in the wintertime, this castle would get freezing cold. Which is you most of the year. You can expect the temperature here in the mm, winter to be yeah, minus that's a, 30 that's a no degrees for me, Celsius. Dog. French provincial castle. Now we're talking. This what is a real... What if I told you that you could live in a French castle Wait, located in, in the Bronx York. in New York? The Bronx? There is no way he shows me a French castle right now in the Bronx and it's not covered in graffiti. There's just no shot. Got a couple crackheads walking out the back, you know? I'm not lying. This French Bronx castle simply won't sell. Built mm. in 1926, oh, this castle ugly, has wallpaper. oak floors and a terraced and a garden. Ooh. But it's been on the market since 2009 and still no one's bought it. Well, well, the housing market crashed, Loma. Right? This is a mix of a castle and a log cabin. Honestly, Granite that's Loma insane. is on Lake Michigan. That's the 26,000 so square foot property has Holy its own hot shit. tub. The original price was- Really? That's what, you're, that's what you're excited about? Look at my castle on the water. It's got a hot tub. Dude, that's f***ing huge. Holy shit. $40 million, but that's oh, been cut in half. 20 I million? Think even Easy. if this was $1, no one would buy it. It's simply way too Come isolated. On. Come the nearest on. town is Let's 200 miles away. But if you love privacy and you're really rich, then privacy. inquire about Granot Loma. Now it's time to make your voice heard. Comment below which castle in okay. this video you would okay. want the most. Listen, if that last one was a dollar, people would be literally murdering each other to go ahead and get it. This is a good question, though. Which castle was the best? Let me know in the comment section below. If I had to pick for myself, I, I gotta go with Neverland Ranch, man. It's in California. It was owned by Michael Jackson. There's some creepy, weird shit going on. I could make so many YouTube videos with all the clickbait titles. Oh, my castle's haunted. The ghost of Michael Jackson's here. Like, you know, you know, you would click on that. Anyway, guys, if you made it to the end of this video, make sure you drop a thumbs up on it. It really helps out the channel a ton. It helps get this video out into the YouTube algorithm. Of course, if you're new around here, make sure you subscribe to the channel and click that bell to be notified the next time that I upload a video. Huge shout out to Top Tens, the YouTube channel that originally created this video. I'm gonna have a link down below in the description and probably in the pinned comments. Make sure you guys go over there and drop a thumbs up on that video as well. Support that video. It was honestly insanely well done. As always, all my social media links are in the description below. So make sure you follow me over there on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, Discord, all that stuff. It's always down below. If you'd like to start building your very own castle right now, you can click the link in the description below to download rise of kingdoms absolutely for free for your pc it's my favorite mobile war strategy game and downloading with the link below helps the channel a ton and with that being said guys thank you so much for watching this has been omni i will talk to you guys again soon peace